Hello, this is Solar PV TV from InterSolar Middle East 2016. Now we are together with uh, Christian, the German guy based here in Dubai since three years. One of the organizers of the, let's say, like a MENA Solar People Club, yes? Yes, we call it Solar Energy Meetup Dubai. Mm -hmm. And it's an informal meetup every month, every second Wednesday in a month in the uh, Media One Hotel in Dubai Media City which is nicely located in the center of Dubai. And we meet with uh, people from the industry and chat in a very informal, uh, personal way. Mm -hmm. And uh, have a drink together and share some information and uh, stories. So it's really a nice setting and uh, always cool people and good talks. How come did you come to Dubai? Well, um, when my company, Solar Praxis, uh, opened this joint venture, um, a colleague of mine um, worked in it uh, from Berlin, but uh, very quick we found out that this doesn't work and somebody had to move over here. And so this, I was uh, uh, chosen. <laughs> and um, I'm, I've been here since three years now, almost three years, and um, I do business development for Solar Praxis, engineering consulting. And um, also now I'm setting up my own business with a, um, a representation for German companies. Mm -hmm. So my slogan is uh, German engineering for the Middle East. So like a German guy here in Dubai. Yes, I'm the German guy. <laughs> yes, the, the German one. <laughs> not the special one, not the normal one, the German one. <laughs> but it's interesting that, you know, we are since three years and uh, it was you actually who started, you know, this meetup uh, meet uh, initiative. Yeah? It's a steady event uh, every month and people show up and uh, we have really nice talks. You, you get information you wouldn't get on a big event, you know, where... where Okay, so that, that's why. Okay, this is this is uh, great actually because uh, today and uh, during next last days we had a lot of uh, great presentations, but they were very official. Yes. Yes. And uh, maybe it would be interesting also to hear, you know, <laughs> a bit more about uh, actually the issues on the market that you that you still see. Eh? Because I mean, we are still at the beginning. The market will be growing for sure, but still there are some yeah. barriers, issues, challenges that we should overcome. Yes. Definitely. Um, um, the biggest, biggest issue is the um, expectation for payback period. Mm -hmm. You know, investors, uh, um, commercial investors uh, who would um, build a PV power plant on their rooftop for net metering, mm -hmm. which is a great thing in Dubai, um, they expect payback periods of two years or so, which is impossible. Um, and this is something you have to work on. There are companies that offer uh, lease agreements, financing, so these people don't have to invest. This is something, this is a so way... Normally they are prepared, you know, that there is a quick return on investment, yeah, yes, like on the here. real estate, yeah. <laughs> over here, everybody is looking to make a killing, you know. Uh, they're all in for the, the quick money, and um, um, everybody... Um, wants to keep his, his uh, um, capex low mm -hmm. and uh, they don't know what's going to happen in the next two years. So um, they think if I invest and have a 10, ba ten year uh, payback period, mm -hmm. I don't know what will be in 10 years. And um, so this is an issue we have to uh, get over. Mm -hmm. And there are some companies who now deal with it and I think uh, this is a very good uh, business model for the, the future in Dubai. What about other issues? Yeah, I mean, uh, um, as everywhere in the Middle East, things uh, move kind of a little bit slower as you expect in Europe, for example, especially the Ramadan season and then the summer break. Um, people who come from Europe are not prepared, you know, for this, that like three months, nothing happens. <laughs> But, but this you have is a lot Dubai. of holidays. Yeah? <laughs> this is Dubai. So go on holiday, enjoy your time, come back in September and <laughs> you see people are coming back. It was very interesting what you said, yeah, that uh, it's completely different for the European guy coming here. So what is like, could you share with our international viewers, what is your experience here and uh, how, let's say, the foreigners should uh, act here in order to be successful in the business? Take your time. Build relationships, that's uh, the most important thing. Um, and uh, move forward step by step, small steps, step by step. And uh, in the long run, there will be success if you follow these, uh, this path. Okay, so um, you are working here on the market in uh, Dubai, of course, but uh, you are also mentioning that uh, you are expanding to other countries, yes? Right. Right. So which countries and uh, how do you see, let's say, the solar future in these countries? 
Uh, Jordan is very interesting because things happen over there. Mm -hmm. There is a steady market. Um, Oman uh, is at the beginning. Don't expect too much too early from Oman. Um, Kuwait has some projects now. Um, there was something in Qadar, but, but um, um, yeah, it will it will develop slowly. So you have to be prepared to be in the long run, especially Saudi Arabia. Uh, it takes a long time uh, until you see the fruits of your work. But yesterday, I think we heard or today about some new changes in the, uh, Saudi Arabia. Yeah? Uh, legislation again. Yes, yes, and uh, I'm, I'm convinced there will be a market, a big, huge market in the future. But uh, so, what will be the next steps for uh, your initiative here in Dubai? Well, we continue to uh, grow steadily and attract more people and um, build a network um, with different uh, types of people who can uh, create synergy. And um, we are also now uh, planning to bring in other industries to educate them about PV mm. in a small setting and uh, talk to them about the issues and how we can together uh, overcome these issues. Yes, because I think that you should uh, not only speak within yourself, yes, right. but uh, to persuade, I don't know, investors, yes. other industries, uh, Hotel. property owners, mm. hotels yeah. and stuff. Yeah. Hotels, commercial customers, architects uh, as well, of course. Um, also, the, the uh, topic of BIPV uh, is totally underestimated over yeah, this here. This is very interesting because uh, today we spoke um, with an uh, advisor to the Minister of Oil in Bahrain. Yeah? So when I asked him what does he think about you know, solar, they are so, so you know, let's say, positive. But maybe they didn't... Uh, expect that there is so a lot of opportunities also in BIPV, yeah? not only on the roof integration, but, you know, transparent windows, for example. Yeah? Yes, there are so many uh, different ways. This is so great for Dubai. Yeah? Yes, I mean, there are so many ways to deploy uh, PV on buildings, uh, not only uh, modules on the rooftop. Mm -hmm. And uh, also there are a lot of um, um, things to do for architects, like design buildings and uh, integrate PV in a very special way, in, in great design. So, um, when I give presentations on PV, I also uh, I always include uh, slides with uh, pictures of uh, BIPV projects with uh, colored uh, or dyed cells and solar can be beautiful, yeah. Semi-transparent uh, modules, yes, and solar can be astonishing. And the last question now with regards to InterSolar, this event in particular. How did you like? Did uh, this event uh, uh, meet your expectations? Yes, actually uh, it's uh, above my expectations. I mean, we have a lot of events in Dubai and um, I was afraid that um, there would be a little bit uh, um, reluctance by the people, but uh, the... the um, the number of visitors were quite good and also the quality of the contacts was exceptional. Ah, because maybe you are German, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I had really extremely fruitful meetings, very interesting uh, conversations and I'm really very, very happy uh, about this event and um, I hope it will take place next year again. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, so how people, just you know, in order to make you some publicity, yeah, how people who are coming, you know, for solar business in Dubai uh, can meet you or can meet at your meetings? What is the contact actually? Yes, we have a, a Facebook page, um, Solar Energy Meetup Dubai, and there is a LinkedIn group, uh, Christian Steinberg on LinkedIn, and um, the Solar en Energy Meetup Dubai LinkedIn group. They can... Um, join the group and then they get all updates about our meetings or they can contact me directly via email uh, steinberg at steinberg.ae Okay, so it was uh, Christian who is, uh, let's say, German representative here in Dubai but also the guy who is uh, trying to unite international solar community in the city. So thank you so much and we will meet up very soon. Thank you very much. <laughs>